This documentary exposes how the continuity of government program has established an all-powerful shadow state. Police State 4 chronicles the sickening depths to which our republic has fallen. Prepare to enter the secretive world of emergency dictatorship. Body scanners, sound cameras, citizen spies, stage terror, and cameras on every street corner. It's only the beginning of the New World Order's hellish plan. The police state isn't coming. It's here. Secure your copy today at Infowars.com or see it online in the highest quality at PrisonPlanet.tv. Diamond Gusset is proud to announce the anthem of the Patriot Movement. They're offering a free CD, T-shirt, and bumper sticker with a qualifying purchase. Diamond Gusset offers great products at great prices while keeping Americans working. I'm looking for a factory where a man can feed his family. Not worried about them moving it south. Closing the doors and shutting her down tomorrow. I'm looking for America. Wear American and be proud. Go to gusset.com forward slash America. The land of the free and the home of the brave. Seems like I just woke up one day and it was gone. Long gone. But I know in my heart it's still Again, go to gusset.com. Forward slash America Today. This is PBR Street Gang. Do you copy? Over. PBR Street Gang is almighty, almighty. I copy. Over. <laughs> well, Charlie Sheen, you haven't uh, been back with us uh, since about a year and a few months ago with your message to President Obama, your 20 minutes with the uh, president that we just re-aired before you uh, joined us. It's uh, great to have you, Charlie. Um, what's your it's take? Still, it's still topical. It's a, it's a, it's a timeless message. It's, it's a timeless message. It's still, it's still right there in the fold. Well, it certainly is. What's your uh, message to uh, President Obama uh, refusing to answer the uh, bullet points uh, that you put down uh, in that key document of the questions surrounding the tragic attacks of 9-11? Well, I would say to, 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 to B.O., <laughs> uh, like, like, how much faith can I possibly have in you to run this entire country when... when uh, 20 questions from a high school dropout sitcom actor appear to be too much to handle for you and your staff. It's like uh, you've had almost two years to deal with this. I wrote them in one hour, and it's like, you know, sorry, but you, sir, are obviously a, a coward in a cheap suit. And the what? bottom line, Alex, is I'm still here. His schedule is public knowledge. It's, it's rocket science. This is not. Quit hiding. It's embarrassing, dude. Next subject. Well, just briefly getting back to Obama for a moment, uh, we did a lot of research for those 20 questions. Things like, Mr. President, six of the 10 commissioners and most of the lawyers on the 9-11 Commission say that the official story is a lie. Please respond to this. Or why did Building 7 fall at free fall speed? Please respond to this. But they don't want to respond to it. Yeah, well, I think just um, I think somebody is running at him right now with a with a with a tape recording of what I just spoke and said they're they're on to us, man. He's back. <laughs> we thought he was dead. Nice try, fellas. Uh, anyway, enough of that. Enough of that. They 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 know the score on that. Let's get the more you know contemporary stuff because just you know what's going on and people are so you know uh, mystified by this, uh, this 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 odyssey that that that, that refuses to stop calling itself Charlie Sheen. Absolutely, Charlie. It was good to see you a few weeks ago at your home. You are Likewise. you are Likewise, looking you, you are looking great and you're completely clean, aren't you? Hundred percent. You know, here's your first P test. Next one goes in your mouth. No, you won't get high. It's all good. It's all good, guys. Quit panicking. Quit panicking. No panic, no judgment. And you're working out even a couple times a day sometimes. 
Um, well, yeah, but there's only one time in the gym if you catch my drift, Alex. Uh, <laughs> oh. Whatever. We're not live, are we? No, we're live. Uh, Charlie, uh, speaking of that, the media... Uh, you don't want to go there. You don't want to ever defend yourself. But you've told me privately most of the stuff, most of the names. It's it's it, it's not true. But what is going on uh, with the women in your life? The goddesses, Alex. The goddesses. Um, let me just say this about the goddesses. I don't believe the term is uh, is good enough. Is good enough. Um, but when you're bound by these uh, these these, these terrestrial uh, descriptions, you must use the best choice available, right? Yes. So if you think about it, dude, it's like I'm over three with marriage, uh, with narrowing excuse, but but like in baseball, the scoreboard doesn't lie, never has. So what what we all have um, is a is a marriage of the heart of the hearts, uh, and I you know to to, to sully to contaminate or you know uh, or radically uh, disrespect this union with a shameful contract is something I will yeah you know leave to the amateurs and the Bible grippers. The Bible grippers. And then I just got to add this. There was a whole firestorm yesterday about, about Brooke being, uh, you know, a part of our a part of our crew. And this, let me just say this. This is all I'm going to say about it was, is that uh, where there were four, um, there are now three. But my Brooke, and uh, good luck in your travels. You're going to need it badly. So. So Brooke did go along with you, but she's not there now. No, she's not there now, and, 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 and we are, and I don't know, winning, anyone? Rhymes with winning, anyone? Yeah, that would be us. <laughs> Sorry, man, didn't make the rules. Oops. Well, well, Charlie, I've known you for six, six and a half years or so, and I knew you when you were completely clean, uh, and then I've known you since, but, but the point is now, I've never seen you, when I was out at your house and talking to you on the phone, so energized as you are now. I mean, you, uh, I mean you're on fire, uh, as Nails uh, told the news yesterday. I mean, I agree with that description. Well, I think it was Nails that said, and I was really, really flattered because he got it right that I'm not, you know, he might be Nails, but I'm freaking bayonets, you know. <laughs> I am battle-tested bayonets, bro, and I'm, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm tired. I'm so tired of pretending like my life isn't perfect and bitching and just winning every second, and I'm not perfect and bitching and just delivering the goods at every freaking turn because look what I'm dealing with, man. I'm dealing with fools and trolls, you know, I'm dealing with, with soft targets, and it's just... You know, it's it's just strafing runs in my underwear before my first cup of coffee because I don't have time for these clowns. I don't have time for their judgment and their stupidity. And, you know, they lay down with their ugly wives in front of their ugly children and just look at their loser lives. And then they look at me and they say, I can't process it. Well, no, and you never will. Stop trying. Just sit back and enjoy the show. You know? Wow, I am uh, I am speechless. Later we're going to get into Apocalypse Now, but what comes to mind is when we were there a few weeks ago watching it in your home theater, uh, when Colonel Kurtz is saying you can you can you can kill me, but you, have you the can't right to kill me, but you do not have the right to judge me. Boom, that's the whole movie. That's life. That's life. There's 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 nobility in that. There's focus. It's genuine. It's crystalline. It's pure, and it's available to everybody. You just shut your traps and put down your McDonald's, your vaccines, your Russ Weekly, your TMZ, and the rest of it, you know, and focus on something that matters. But you can't focus on things that matter if, 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 if all you've been is asleep for 40 years. Funny how asleep runs with sheep, you know? Anyway, we're getting off topic. No, uh, Charlie, we don't I mean, even have I mean, is a it. Topic, we don't care anymore, Alex. We don't care. Is it we fair to talk about this work thing, bro? Let's get to the work business because there's been a lot of speculation, a lot of rumors. Imagine that with the media. Well, sure. Let's go over that because when I was there two weeks ago at your house, you looked great, totally clean. Uh, you were working out super hard. I went and worked out with you at that private uh, uh, gym. I mean, they put you through an incredible workout. Uh, you know, you're there exercising in the pool uh, later, and you're saying, "Look, I'm ready to go to work. I'm ready to go right now." And then they add the lie that, "Oh, you don't have." a hernia well you know what i've seen your hernia i've got the same hernia in my belly button and 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 and, and your hernia was hurt but again you don't want to defend yourself on that and, and and you know tell folks the truth about it but the point is uh is that uh it seems like there's some people uh, uh in your life that are trying to demonize you they're doing these vanity cards talking about how they're going to outlive you it, it seems pretty darn aggressive yeah, I didn't care about that vanity card. In fact, I went straight on with that one and just dispelled that. And that was actually, a, you know, one of the few compliments that clown has paid me in freaking almost a decade. Um, but I'm excited to get back to 
work, um, and not to completely discount what you just talked about. It's just if I if I if I bring up these these these, these turds, these little hormoncules, losers. This is there's, <laughs> there's no reason to, to 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 then you know bring them back into the fold because I have real fame. They have they have nothing. They have zero. They have they have that night, and I will I will forget about them as uh, as the last image of them exits my beautiful home, and um, and they will get out there and they will sell me, and then they will lose, and they will lose the rest of their lives as they think about me and my life the rest of their life. So it's just there's no it's again bring me a challenge, somebody bring me a freaking challenge because you know it just ain't there. Winning, but, but you're ready to go to, back to work right now. Well, yeah, but but. I had to tell you, and, I'm, and you know, I'm tired of being told like, "Oh, you can't talk about that. You can't talk about that." Bull s h i t. Let me just say this: that it's nothing. Uh, uh, this side of deplorable that a certain Heim Levine, yeah, that's Chuck's real name, uh, mistook this rock star for his own selfish exit strategy, bro. Check it, Alex. I embarrassed him in front of his children and the world by healing at a pace that, that his unevolved mind cannot process. Okay, last I checked, Heim, uh, I've spent, I think, close to the last decade, I don't know, effortlessly and magically converting your, your tin cans into pure gold. And the gratitude I get in this, get is, is this charlatan chose not to do his job, which is to write. Clearly someone who believes he is above the law. Well, you've been warned, dude. Bring it. Charlie, everybody that I know that knows you, and, I've, and I know you well, talks about how behind the scenes you give incredible amounts of money to charity. You help people. You give things to everybody. You, you, know, you go out and help firemen and, and school children. I mean, you but genuinely are a nice guy, but you've always just let people attack you and lie about you. And in the years I've known you and in the years people that have known you for decades, they say Charlie is on fire. And after he came out of what he's been in the last seven months, he is he is not putting up with people trying to push him around anymore. Is that fair to say? It's it's yeah, it's an understatement. You know, it's um, I just I'm sorry, man. I got I got I got magic and I got poetry at my fingertips. And I'm, you know, at uh, most of the time. And this is, you know, this includes naps. You know, I'm a, I'm a, I'm an F-18, bro, and I will I will destroy you in the air, and I will I will I will deploy my ordinance uh, to the ground. Are you going to announce uh, your new uh, tattoo here on air? Yeah, why not? Because it's just pure, pure and complete gnarlyisms. Um, yeah, I sat with two. Uh, hey, coincidence! Uh, F-18, the Top Gun, radical fire, napalm dropping pilots in my movie theater, watching the. Attack sequence that did the chopper attack sequence on the beachhead to go surfing because they wanted to and those people were in their way um, and I and I was getting a tattoo during the the the, the, the death from above and it was a uh, it's the banner from the death card that that Kilgore is throwing on his victims but there's also falling from it is the uh, is the apple from the giving tree there's my life deal with it oh wait can't process it losers winning bye bye. <laughs> when are we going to see this tattoo? Uh, well, if my man, um, if my man Steve is listening, I'm sure it'll be it'll be, uh, it'll be headed to you in in, in uh, you know just a matter of moments. Well, that's awesome, Charlie. I know you've got some surprises coming up in the next few weeks, but we'll let you roll those uh, surprises out. Uh, moving on along here, a Major League Three, your other two were giant uh, hits, and uh, I knew the inside baseball of some of the planning uh, for that. You told me about it a while back, but now it looks like it's really starting to come together. Uh, tell us about uh, when we're going to be looking for Major League Three and who's going to be in it. Major League Three, I don't know. I haven't read it. I don't care.